Gagarico. Maybe we should wait till the day. Daytime. Gagarico? Gagarico. Death Mountain. They just call it that because it's a real... It's a real strong hike. Death to your quads. There's guards here. Ding dong, ding dong. I'm a clock soldier of Kakariko. Current time is 8.08. Hello there, son. Zelda's attendant, the great impo, opened this village to the common people. We have only a small population now, but someday... This place will be as lively as Hyrule Castle Town. Oh, yes, it will. Climb up the stairs at the north end of this village to find the trail that leads up to Death Mountain. But you need the king's permission to actually go up to the mountain. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's the shadow. Cool. Oh, but then she goes in you, and then there's the sun. Neat. There's the sun there. Well, how about that? It's a nice, that's a nice detail. They never leave their posts day or night. Mm -hmm. There she is. Woo! That's cool. I'm the boss of the carpenters at Impa Hired to improve this village and make it into a true city. But young men these days don't have any ambition. You know what I mean, kid? My workers are just running aimlessly around the village, and they're not making any progress at all. Even my own son doesn't have a job. He just wanders around all day. They're all worthless, I tell you. Well, if all of them are a problem, then maybe it's you that's the problem. Huh? Which I'm motivating him, you son of a bitch. The game's towns have more NPCs than buildings? More NPCs than buildings, or more NPCs in the towns than the buildings have? What the fuck is wrong with your mouth? This is the first time you visited the village. A great woman, Impa, opened up this village to us poor folk. Well, make yourself at home. The food isn't ready yet, though. That's very nice of you. Smash. Up, 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 up. Look at these guys. Maybe you just hired people that should be dancers and performers rather than uh, construction workers. We we're working. Why am I reading like Adam Sandler? I was wondering who that voice was. It was just the way her mouth looked. I formed my mouth like hers, and that is what came out. I was hoping it wasn't something racist. I'm glad it was just an Adam Sandler thing. Question mark. Wait, oh, yeah, this guy's crazy, isn't he? Oh yeah. <laughs> Go round and round and round, what fun, I'm so happy. I'm a music man who loves to go round and around, go round and around, right round, like a record baby, round, round, right round. I'm trying to come up with a musical theme inspired by this windmill, going round and around and around. Song of Storm! Adam Sandler being anti-Semitic? Well, I guess he can be. Oh yeah, isn't there some, like, time paradox where you learn the Song of Storms from this guy in the future to teach him in the past? So that he can teach you in the future? We tra la 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 We're working so hard, building lots of things. Have you seen Mr. Dampe who lives in the graveyard up ahead? It's 808, so he's probably asleep in his hut. Go out onto the field and kill some time. Alright. We gotta go see Dompe at night. Yeah. I mean, and it looks like he's playing the song because... 
Oh. In here. What's down the well? That's the best sound effect. Like, no compression to it. Oh god. He'll come back. Don't fall off. Don't fall off. Son of a bitch! Look at that poor girl over there. She works so hard taking care of her chickens. Even though touching them gives her goosebumps. Is she in love with the chickens? What a trooper. I'd really like to help her. I've just been feeling so charitable these days. Don't you feel that way too? Son of a bitch. Alright, woman with the chickens. Dompe at night. Oh, her beautiful hair. What should I do? My cuckoos have all flown away. You little boy, please. Please help me bring them back to this pen. Bring back my cockos. <laughs> okay. First one's easy. You got it. My cockos have run away. Catch six more. Holy moly. If heaven was one video game world, which would it be? One video game world. It would be... It would be... Um, the Breath of the Wild world for me. I could, I could just explore that. And live there forever. Always finding something new. Yeah. Or maybe, I don't know, Dead or Alive Beach Volleyball. Always that. What? It's a pretty big town. Catching the chickens, catching... Oh yeah, and you fly with these guys, right? And you float. That's fun. That's really fun. Ooh. Hmm. Soon you'll have no feathers. Nice! Can you herd them back? That'd be cool. Move. Go back. I'll chop you up. There you go. Hey lady, why don't you help out? Still missing some cuckoos. Final Fantasy XII, uh, Great World? Breath of the Wild world map is a little small. Spent a hundred hours catching these things as a kid, though. Does this one have the Zelda thing where if you attack one of them enough, an army comes and gets you? Oh, shoot. I don't... I don't know. Listen. What would Sarah say if we told her we're going to save Hyrule? Well, we can always go back and talk to her. See if she's jealous. Got a letter here from the princess. Jealous? I'm the hero of time. Jealous? I have this cool hat and I can leave Kakariko Village and see the rest of the world. Jealous? Oh, you live the rest of your life here? This used to be the great Impus house, but she doesn't live here any longer. It is now open to all villagers. Go on in. Well, it used to be the Shika village. But the Great Impa opened it to everyone. That's nice. I 
Oh. Oh. So cruel. I mean, as long as the cow has a big backyard to play in, and that's that's just so the cow can come in and say hello. Whoa! Rupees, my boy. You must explore. Hey! Whoa, where'd you come from? Hey, kid. Do you always enter other people's houses without permission? Didn't your parents teach you any manners? Uh, the guard told me I could. Oh, well. Did you see a lady behind this house? She's going through hard times. Oh, well. That lady asks you about chickens, you should listen to her. Interesting. Why did that guy contradict what the guard had said? What do you think of that guard? Hmm? I need to find out where that- how that cow got in. Oh, I need to get up there. Okay. Maybe I need a chicken. Look at that camera work. Wonderful. There is no chicken up here, but you get a good view. See, I was trying to press C up. Okay, chicken up there. One. I know there's one by the entrance. My little boy isn't here right now. I think he went to play in the graveyard. Part really reminded me of Bloodborne for some reason. Yes, I believe he went to the graveyard. <laughs> Hunter. Job where you can make a lot of money without much effort? The only thing I can think of is thievery. Is that a bad idea? I wonder what they were trying to say with these workers that were lazy. Yeah, it's just a kid. You can't read. Hey, I got this note, dick. Oh, this is surely a Princess Zelda's handwriting. Well, let's see. Okay. This is Link. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. Ha 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 funny game has our princess come up with now. All right, all right. You can go now. Just be careful, Mr. Hero. By the way, Mr. Hero, if you're gonna climb Death Mountain, you should equip a proper shield. It's an active volcano, after all. If you go back to Hyrule Castle Town Market, you should check out the bazaar. They sell the shield you need there. Tell them I sent you, and they should give you a special discount. If you think you're good to go already, don't worry about it. Now, I'd like to ask a favor of you. No, I don't expect you to do it. Just because of the great tip I gave you, but I'm just asking. Have you been to the Happy Mask shop that just opened in Hyrule Castle Town Market? Everyone is talking about it. My little boy pesters me for a popular mask, but I don't have time to go there working 24 hours a day. So could you go and get the mask for me next time you're in the market? If you don't feel like it, fuck you. I have no choice. This is my job. Sigh. Oops. Woohoo! Death Mountain Trail! Oh! God! Brutal Hours as an NPC. I'm excited about that uh, Ryan Reynolds movie, Free Man. Or Free Guy. I don't know if I like the name, but it could be fun. Interesting to see how video gamey it is. It often seems like with the video game stuff, they don't quite understand it. You know, are you gonna have little in jokes for the. Oh, what the, what the fuck?
forgot my piano was turned on. <sighs> I've got it in a, sl a sliding drawer here. Yeah, it is. It is rushed when you finally... Oh, this goes here? Beep, beep, beep. You know that it's going to open up a whole new path for you. Jesus, Link. Oh. Yes. Hello. I am one of the Gorons, the stone-eating people who live on Death Mountain. Look at that huge boulder over there. It blocks the entrance to the Dodongo's Cavern, which was once a very important place for us Gorons. But one day, many Dodongos suddenly appeared inside the cavern. It became a very dangerous place, you see. On top of that, a Gerudo in black armor used his magic to seal the entrance with that boulder. If you want to hear more Goron gossip, head up to our city. Goron City is just a little way up the trail. Won't take much longer to get there, even on foot. Are there hearts here? Because I need hearts. Oh, three hearts? Oh my gosh. Dadongo. Even in Zelda, they have masks. No. They say that a beautiful fairy lives on top of the Death Mountain. Don't you want to see her? Yeah. Eat through it, Gorons! That's cannibalism. Death Mount Trail. Mountain Summit, danger ahead. Keep out. The little uh those the uh, town lights lit up back there gives it a nice cozy look nice landmark oh bombs i'm standing here to shade the bomb flowers from the sun do you have a question for me bomb flowers those plants growing over there, bomb flowers, they are mining plants that grow only in this mountain. They usually grow only in dark places. Like caves. So bomb flowers that grow in a place, I guess they're extremely rare. If you have the Goron's bracelet, even a little kid like you could easily pick it up with a... But Dodongo's Cavern. Did you see the cavern on your way here? That is the Dodongo's Cavern. Because the light inside is very dim, the bomb flowers, a plant unique to this mountain, grow like crazy in there. Oh. Yeah, you never noticed that, Daryl? I, I, I have no memory of that the first time I played. I have no memory of my mother. Return of the Jedi. Luke talking to Leia. Telling her that Darth Vader is her dad. Go Ron City. Go Ron. Go Ron. Oh, I'm so hungry. Me too. Everyone feels faint from hunger because of the food shortage in this town. We're in danger of extinction. It's all because we can't enter our quarry, the Dodongo's Cavern. 
We Gorons live on a diet of rocks. The most delicious and nutritious rocks around are found on the Dodongles Cavern. But that seems like ancient history now. We've become such gourmets that we can't stand eat rocks from anywhere else. Rocks don't regenerate, unless you poop out rocks. I want to eat the top sirloin rocks from Dodongo's Cavern. Yeah, I gotcha. Nice. I'm very proud of myself. Hey, it's dangerous for a little kid like you to come out of here. You might fall down. If I'm not mistaken, you came out here to eat the red stone. Too bad. It's not here. It's not why you're here. If you're looking for a spiritual stone? You must mean that delicious looking red stone that was once displayed here. Where is it now? I was so hungry that I thought it would be okay to just give it one tiny little lick. So I snuck out here. But it was already gone. I think Big Brother took it away. He always says that everyone is after that red stone. Big Brother shut himself up in his room, saying, I will wait in here for the royal family's messenger. Hint, hint. Where's his room? Okay. Big Brother. Nice, I got these bombs. Too heavy. Oh no. Isn't that sucking Zelda when you, you're maxed out on rupees? Looks like you need to buy a wallet. <laughs> That's where I came from. Don't go there. That's handy. What? Hot? Zvit? What? Oh shit. That ain't gonna work. Where's his room? Oops. Might as well save. Now that I'm here. A restore point has been created. Goron City. Double save. Where's Big Brother? Big Brother has shut himself up in his room. Is this it? It doesn't work here. Where's his fucking room? <laughs> Can easily be a Goron too. You need that arm tattoo. You dye your hair. Oh yeah, I do have cool tattoos. Just the tiniest bit of bleach blonde hair. It's almost like a sort of like a the Jewish hat, the Hebrew hat. Is that? Is that the room? This looks like an important room. This is where I just was. The platform in the lava beneath it in Mario 64. I love the lava. I love that when Mario lands on the lava, it launches him up into the air. That black singe of smoke. You know it's painful, but you could use it to get really high. Okay, we're not going through there. Big brother. I might, yeah, I might need to go, hey you. No. Yeah, okay. I stand right here. Aha! Uh -huh. You're standing on a soft carpet for guests. It feels so plush into your feet. Guests. Right, so how would a guy behind a door see a letter? You need to do something that he can hear. I'm a bloody fool. 
Where's my work arena? There it is. We need to say we built this city on rock and rock. We built this city rock and rock. So is this guy going crazy protecting the redstone like Gollum? What the heck? Who are you? When I heard the song of the royal family, I expected their messenger had arrived, but you're just a little kid. Has Darunia, the big boss of the Gorons, really lost so much status to be treated like this by his sworn brother, the king? Now I'm really angry. Get out of my face. Now. You asking why I'm in such a bad mood? Ancient creatures have infested the Dodungo's cavern. We've had a poor harvest of our special crop, bomb flowers. Starvation and hunger because of the rock shortage. I feel like this guy's playing a really bad round of SimCity. But... This is a Goron problem. We don't need any help from strangers. Everyone's very xenophobic in this game. Except for Link. This is a Goron problem. Fuck off. Dude. I can help you. He loves that. He dances. Oh, look how happy he is. That's not quite what I was looking for. Uh, I wanted to hear a tune, something uh, from outside the mountain, something green, natural. That's the kind of music I want to hear. Uh... Oopsie. You like that? No? You want to hear a better song? Alrighty. Look at this guy. Look at this. Ah. Oh. Here's Big Brother's secret, but he loves to dance. If he gets in a rhythm, he'll surely. All right. Oblisk the tormentor. And all the torches in this floor are lit. Corn City's really lively. Okay, so we need to find this right melody. Forest medley. Okay, so maybe we need to go back and learn that song. Okay, well, we'll have to do that next time. I wonder what happens next time. <laughs>